What's up you guys? Welcome to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be doing my high school makeup routine. This is like really, really crazy to me because it made me realize I've been out of high school for like almost six years now. Literally like was looking at pictures. Obviously I'm gonna put the pictures up of what I looked like in high school. But I have been looking at pictures all morning, like trying to think like, oh my gosh, like I remember everything that I did, which was absolutely like nothing. I remember what I did, but it's like crazy to me because I'm like, I really like remember the first time I bought any contour kits or eyeshadow kits. And that's when I first started watching YouTube, probably like my junior year. Um, and I ordered everything off of Amazon. I ordered a pack of makeup brushes, um, cause before I was using like Target makeup brushes, like the Eco Tools ones, which I still have some Eco Tools ones. These probably could be from high school, honestly. Um, but I always wash my brushes. They've still, they've still been hanging in there, so. Hold on. Baby, I'm filming. was these eco tools brushes has, have really lasted me but i remember hopping on amazon and like finding makeup brushes and just finding a bunch of like cool stuff before i was using like those bronzers i was using like this this rimmel bronzer as blush these are not like um old items from high school these are actually new oh not new but newer maybe like a month old I went out and bought a lot of my OG products because it wasn't like for this video or anything, but it was just like, I was at Walgreens and I was like, gosh, I used to love these like when I was in high school. So this foundation, like I'm sure you guys know about this, uh, Elf I think was kind of like, it was, I don't know how old Elf was, but I was just discovering what Elf was in high school. So I was using like a lot of Elf products because my mom really wouldn't buy me makeup. I would have to like buy it myself or get my dad to buy it and I would just throw it like when we go to Target to get like toiletry stuff I would just throw the makeup in the bag I still do that to this day like if he takes me to Walmart like for something or if he's buying something and I just go with him I'm like throw it in the bag <laughs> okay so let's just get into it beauty blenders were not hot around this time you guys it was like those little makeup sponges but I never use those sponges my mom always used to use the sponges but I just didn't do that I would always use like this like real text technique brush that I actually think that this is still from high school I just found it so I'm gonna be using this for my foundation um okay so I'm just gonna get right into it so I would just pour a little bit of foundation on my oh that's a lot I still use this foundation you guys I love it no primer no nothing I don't even think I moisturized my face back in the day but I would just kind of put it all over the place like that. And one thing that I wouldn't do would be like a bunch of like layers. So like whatever this first layer would do. Because mind you, like when we were in high school, we woke up at like 6 in the morning. If you're still in high school and watching this video, you know how it goes. Like I'm sure you guys beat your face now because like everybody beats their face. But I, nah. Sleep has always been important to me. So it would go like this, and I'm pretty sure my foundation was streaky as hell back then. No concealer whatsoever. Okay, so after I apply my foundation, my next step would be just to put blush and bronzer. Blush and bronzer I'd put in the same areas. I wouldn't take my bronzer back like that ever. I would just get like a brush, whatever brush I had, and I would just move it like that. And I would go like that. Okay, and then I'd get my brush. <laughs> this is so funny. I'd get my uh, blush that I would use and I would just do the same thing. Put it right there. Like all over the cheeks, like not even the apples of the cheeks. I would do it 
everywhere. I like from <laughs> so cringy. Yeah. Okay, I didn't put any eyeshadow on either. I remember that there was one time when I had like a little eyeshadow trio thing. I think it was from Wet n Wild. They used a lot of Wet n Wild products. I'm sure we all did. Um, and I put like a little bit of silver. It was for my birthday. I think I have a picture. I'll put that picture. I I remember I put a little silver eyeshadow on and I did like a little wing liner and I was like feeling myself. So after that I would do my brows. So for my brows it's like the same thing now. I would just do them really quickly. It wasn't I just was doing my brows because people were doing their brows. I had no reason to do my brows but I just would do them. And I would use a pomade and it would be this elf pomade. So I just get a little bit on a blood a brush like this and I just remember I probably was like looking crazy I remember I would like draw a line like that darken my whole brow up like that and then I would just brush through there you go next step and this is like I'm pretty much almost done with this you guys my next step would be if I decided to put top eyeliner on it would never be a wing I would just put the top eyeliner like over it But that was rare occasion, like if I wanted to switch it up, like if I had a cute outfit on, I was like, I'm going to put top eyeliner. But something that I always did, and it's so funny, I told my best friend I was going to film this video, and she was like, oh my god, I remember how you used to do your makeup, you used to just put bottom eyeliner on, that's it. This is like giving me like a blast from the past. Then I would use an e.l.f. mascara. I remember specifically it was either an e.l.f. mascara or it was the, you know that little orange one? I think that was a CoverGirl one, which I don't have that. But I still use e.l.f. mascaras because e.l.f. mascara is actually pretty good. Like it's not bad at all. I put some obviously on the bottom. Oh my god, this is so funny. If I put lipstick on, it would be a MAC lipstick. I have a few MAC lipsticks in here, but the one that I used to use, me and my best friend like raved over it, was Whirl. And I'm sure everybody knows what it is, but it was MAC Whirl. And we went to MAC, I remember we both went to MAC together at the same time. And we both bought like our first MAC lipsticks. Um, I don't know if she remembers that, but that was like my first lipstick. Ugh, I love the am I the only one that loves the smell of matte lipsticks? They smell so bomb. These are both dark. Well, no, that's not good. But yeah, I would just put chapstick on and I would literally call it a day. This is so funny. I want to zoom into my eyes so you guys can see. I literally feel like I'm in high school again. This is so weird. <laughs> Okay guys, so there you have it, my high school makeup routine. Um, a lot has changed, obviously. I put on lipstick every single day. I never wear bottom eyeliner. I don't put my blush like like that on the, like I put my blush like mixed in with my contour. I use concealer, I use setting spray, I use primer, I use setting powder and different found there's just so much highlighter like this is my high school makeup routine i'd get up every single morning at six in the morning do this throw on my clothes and walk out of the house as always thank you guys so much for watching this video